Imagine spending countless hours in the scorching heat of the African savanna searching for food, the basic necessity that most of us take for granted. Baboons do this every day to keep their well-being and stay alive. An adult baboon's diet mainly consists of grass. A common grass that imbecile baboons eat is called Sprobilus ringi, which helps keep the baboons sustained during long and dry seasons. Baboons also eat insects inside elephant dung and nuts, mainly palm. They will also eat seeds. The most common type of seed they eat are the acacia seed. They are small, black, lentil-shaped, soft, dry, and the baboons usually get them from green pods. They will also eat fruit, known as the orange fruits from Elysium bush. Baboons will also eat tree sap from fever trees, roots, herbs, blossoms, water, and bark. Because baboons are omnivores, they will occasionally eat meat. This includes birds, fish, shellfish, lizards, eggs, hares, vervet, monkeys, rodents, and sometimes even larger animals such as antelope and sheep. Commonly, baboons will often eat human trash and food since they are scavengers, and they will eat whatever they find that's edible. Baboons are very adaptable to their environment, so if the environment changes, so will their diet. Baboons mainly try to find food high in proteins and lipids and low in fiber and potential contents. This is what Dr. Archie has to say on the subject. Some of their most common foods include grass. They eat the blades. They also will dig up the whole grass plant and eat the really nutritious growing part of the roots that's underground. They eat um, acacia pods. So acacias are those big feathery trees you can see in the background and they make pods that have seeds in them. They eat them when they're fresh. It's sort of like eating snow peas, I think. They also eat them when they're dry and the dried seeds look a lot like dried lentils. So it's like not that, it's, it's a pretty harsh diet, right? It's hard on your teeth. Baboons and humans share the same structure of the amount of teeth they have. Baboons are able to eat on the run because their cheeks can hold a stomach worth of food. According to Dr. Archie, a professor at the University of Notre Dame, baboons store food in their cheeks for upcoming meals. When walking, baboon shoulders are higher than their hips, which help them by being able to see what is going on as they forage for food. When feeding on the food the baboons forage, baboons stand on three of their limbs and use their remaining hand to pluck and eat the food. Why do baboons like elephant dung? Well, as you already may know, the Amboseli is a very dry place. In most of the country of Kenya, the coolest seasonal months are July and August, with temperatures falling in the 50 degrees Fahrenheit range. In February and March, temperatures can rise to 93 degrees Fahrenheit. This means that many animals, including baboons, have limited options to a fresh water source, and when they get the chance to get any drop of moisture, they'll take it. You might think that baboons' only source to get any type of moisture would be from a watering hole. But really, baboons have another way of receiving it. Baboons enjoy elephant dung. Elephant dung can be found all over, considering elephants roam the Amboseli with the baboons. In order for the baboons to get the moisture out of the dung, they'll put a handful of the dung in their mouth and then suck on it. Since dung is usually wet, the baboons have a source of moisture to replace what would be water. But, not only can you get moisture out of elephant dung, you may also get something to eat as well. Many times, flies and beetles will be on the dung because flies plant their eggs on it, and beetles are attracted to it to receive any leftover nutrients. When baboons cannot find water, they find liquid by digging up roots and tubers. In dry riverbeds, baboons dig holes to find water. They collect their water supply from rain, dew from plants, streams, and large bodies of water. Baboons can also drink the night dew on their fur for water. In conclusion, Amboseli baboons have a diverse diet. They eat anything from grass to antelopes to human food such as french fries, thus making Amboseli baboons very adaptable to their environment and perfectly suited for any change that crosses their path.